Morning, everybody. It is Wednesday, April 22nd. Um, today is Earth Day. Um, and Earth Day, you know, it's actually the 50th anniversary of Earth Day. Earth Day, we, we might think of as being like a, a science thing, but Earth Day is really, it's a social studies topic, too. Um, it's people advocating for the government to step up and change policies and, and to impact the world around them, which, you know, is, is right in there with government studies and the way that people interact and society works. Um, so Earth Day has is, is been around as a movement for the last 50 years um, as a way of people taking voice to the government, people pressing the government to try to make changes um, for the, the betterment of the environment, pollution, population, you know, etc. Um, and even though it's fairly cold and miserable outside today, you know, if, if you wanted to partake in some Earth Day activities, I mean, you could maybe go out and put some gloves on and a mask because of the coronavirus um, and pick up, you know, trash along the roadside. Um, I, I don't know if that's a great idea because of social distancing um, and because it's miserable and cold out. But you could also maybe, you know, you start some, some house plants, um, you know, start some plants that you could put in a little garden later on. Um, one of the big side effects of this whole corona uh, shutdown of the world is that people are looking to take up gardening more and more. Like finding garden seeds has been harder this year because people are like trying to, to be more self-sufficient which also ties right in with the idea of Earth Day. So, um, you know, this was a, an avocado that, you know, if you ever have avocados, it's got that big pit in the middle of it. And if you take that and you actually just wet it and put it just barely covered like in a yogurt cup, um, it will sprout and eventually turn into a, a tree. So it's a pretty cool project that you could start in your house. Um, you know, if, if you were lucky enough to get near a store you know, they, like I have one of these window uh, windowsill um, gardening containers that I'm going to put some herbs in, some basil and, uh, you know, some, some herbs for the garden. Get them started in there, and then once, you know, it warms up finally past frost, then maybe we could get them planted outside in the garden. Um, and you may say, well, I live in a village, I can't have a garden. You still can. I mean, a lot of the stuff you could put in flower pots, um, you know, little containers alongside on the steps by your house and the little area you know, where it's protected. So, you know, things to think about that maybe, you know, you could do little impacts and uh, with today being Earth Day, maybe you could uh, start yourself on a, on a pathway to gardening. Um, and, you know, it's, it's also, it's, a lot of people find it as a stress reliever. I love to get out and dig in the garden and, and uh, work and, and see the things that I've been planting and growing, um, you know, grow and then be able to, to eat and cook with those things. So, you know, something to think about. Again, happy Earth Day, 50 years uh, for the Earth. Um, on other more specific class matters, um, again, you've got your two assignments for the week. Please make sure that you're going and getting those taken care of. Um, your Industrial Revolution, I've seen a bunch of people have already turned that in. Um, so keep working on that. Get those main ideas down. And then work on your, your eyewitness to history. Get your journaling turned in so that by the end of the week you've got your, your two assignments done. Um, as always, you know, look at your other classes. Social studies might be the most important class, but it's not the only class that you have. So make sure that you're checking in on your other classes as well and getting work done for those teachers. Um, make sure that you're looking at your Google Classrooms. Reach out to your teachers by email if, if you need you know, questions, if you have issues. Um, as always, you know, wash your hands. Stay away from people, wear a face mask, you know, protect yourself, protect each other, um, and I will talk to you tomorrow.